Hi guys, welcome to Ladder Than Words Autism. I appreciate all of you guys supporting our journey and supporting my son, putting all this effort he is into doing life so well and so beautifully. This video is really just a recording of us at a speech therapy appointment. We still obviously work on prompting and you know verbal cues and trying to get him to see how we move our mouth, feel how we move our mouth, things like that. However, we switched a lot of our focus over to nonverbal communication. So a lot of what you're gonna see is us working on um, high-tech AAC, so like a speech device. And the one that we're using in this particular example is gonna be sounding board. We also are using really big pictures. He responds better with big pictures and actual photographs of the items. Um, remember, if you guys like the video, make sure you like the video. Um, you know, subscribe, the things, and whatnot. Ah, look at that hat. Ah, choo. <laughs> In every therapy session, we model three different types of nonverbal communication, or AACs. Oh. In this first exercise, you're going to see us modeling sign language. Ah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Should we do more? So just in case you're wondering why we choose to model sign language, the picture communication system, and the speech device, Eli currently does not communicate in any functional way, whether it be verbal or nonverbal. So the idea behind this is that when he is ready to communicate, he will have all of these options available to him so he can choose whatever is easiest and most efficient for him. <laughs> Silly bum. Yeah, my bob. I thought he was about to touch it. Okay, how about we look at the ball? Yeah. Come on. Ball? No, ball. So what you're seeing right now is what is considered high-tech AAC or a speech device. Now, speech devices come in many different kinds. This is an iPad with a speech app downloaded to it to make it into a speech device. It might be hard to believe from watching the video, but Eli has actually been responding better to the speech device than he has with any of the other AAC options we've been providing for him. So he will probably be using the speech device predominantly in the near future. Yeah. <gasps> Name. You give it 
Do you think he's shake, 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 shake. Do you think that's what he said? I don't know. I think if he if he was saying it, it was kind of like in an imitative yeah. way. Oh, I know it's a warming set. Okay, bye, kitty. Bye, bye. Uh. Like, bye. So <gasps> aggressive. Of course. <laughs> nice. The activity you see here is him practicing using a device to help him more efficiently navigate his speech device in the future. Bye-bye, Horace. It's also been proven beneficial for autistic children to learn from iPads or devices at times, rather than also having to focus on the struggle of interaction while trying to take in that new information. In Eli's case specifically, you can see him putting more focus onto the animals and the animal sounds rather than if it were just him and his speech language pathologist working face to face. I've never been able to really get him to dance. I want to close out this video by thanking everybody for all of the amazing support that we've been getting. A ton of things have changed since we were last active on this channel, so I'm going to play a few clips of Eli recently playing and doing his thing. Um, he has progressed so much. A lot of people have asked how he's been doing and how things have changed, and to answer that, a ton of things have changed in amazing ways. Uh, some things have changed in ways that aren't so amazing, and that's just kind of how progress and growth is for every child, I think. <laughs> I'm gonna try to do an update video as soon as I'm able to to let you guys know exactly how he's doing and the things that he has progressed on and just how far he's come, which is pretty far to be honest. It's amazing. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're glad to be back. And if you guys have any questions or comments, make sure you leave them down below for me to read and get back to you guys. And we are going to try to get back into the swing of things.